Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I explain to you how to enable a remote desktop, using group policy, and create GPO and apply it to users to enable a remote desktop on client computers, and a remote desktop is a feature of operating system, that allows user to connect to device computer in another location, and see and interact with that computer's desktop, as if it were local. I will walk you through the steps of using GPO to enable a remote desktop step by step. First, open Server Manager dashboard, then click on Tools menu, from the top of page, and from menu click on Group Policy Management. Then expand the foreset, and select the domain that you will work on. Then right click on the Group Policy object, and from the menu select New. Then, enter an appropriate name for this policy in the new GPO window, so that you can access it later. Then click on OK button. Next, right click on the GPO that was just created, and from menu click on Edit. This will open Group Policy Management Editor window. After that, go to the left sidebar and expand the folders to access the path that appears in front of you on the screen, and I will leave the path for you in the description of the video. After reaching the path, go to the other side of the available policies, and find allow users to connect remotely by using remote desktop services policy, and double click it to open it. Then enable this policy, click on the apply button and OK. After that, I will go to the left sidebar to open another path, which is shown in front of you on the screen. After reaching the path, go to the other side of the available policies and find require user authentication for remote connections by using network level authentication policy and double click it to open it. Also enable this policy, then click on the apply button and then the OK button. Next I will create allow port for remote desktop through Windows Firewall. So, go to the path shown in front of you on the screen Then click on Inbound Rules on the right. Then right click on Inbound Rules, and from the menu select New Rule. Then from the new Inbound Rule Wizard window, select Port, then click the Next button. Then enter the port of the remote desktop, which is TCP3389 port, and click the Next button. And in this step, select Allow the connection, and click on the Next button to continue. Then click on the next button, and in this step, specify the name and description of this rule, and click on finish button after that. This creates an incoming rule that allows port 3389 along with the Enable Remote Desktop GPO policy. You can now close the Group Policy Management Editor window, and the last step is to link this policy to the organizational unit you want, so you can apply it to a specific organizational unit, or apply it at the domain level. Next, test enable a remote desktop GPO on client machines. I hope the video is useful to you. And thank you for watching, and I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.